Hello Dumela and you guys and welcome back to my channel Kani Lucky Diana and I'm back with another video Today we are making creamed spinach without any mushrooms or cream of mushroom soup So to start you will need butter 2 tablespoons of butter And for this video the spinach that I'm going to use today, I actually got it like weeks or a week ago and I pre-cooked it, not overly cooked but just to blanch it and then I cooled it and pack it in my plastic, I don't know, plastic bags, the small ones and then I put it in the fridge. So if you have your spinach fresh you can just cut it and put it in the pot after the butter has melted so this is how my spinach looks like after i took it out of the fridge it's very frozen so i will need to defrost it before i start with everything else so i'm just going to put it inside the pot and let it defrost for a bit and then we will continue after that And now this is how the spinach looks after I defrosted it and it does have a bit of liquid at the bottom and now I'm just going to let it simmer out and reduce the liquid so that I could go ahead and add my milk. If maybe you are interested in the way that I preserve the spinach, all you need to do is put the spinach inside your pot and then let it um, reduce in size and then you don't add anything, no water, no salt, nothing. You just let it cook down and then you store it. Now this is how the spinach looks after some time and we don't have a lot of liquid at the bottom. And now you're going to add in your milk. This is a quarter cup of milk. And I don't use fresh milk. So I used powdered milk plus warm water. And then I mix it all together and put it inside my pot. But if it happens that you have yourself fresh milk, any kind of milk, coconut milk, almond milk, or lactose free milk, anything that looks like milk you can use it here now you're just going to let it simmer down and reduce the liquid And now this is how it looks. It looks really rough. And in here, I'm going to make my slurry, which is just liquid and a bit of flour as a thickener. And then I'm going to put it inside my pot. If maybe you have yourself cream of mushroom soup, you don't have to use flour. You can use your cream of mushroom soup as your thickener and it's going to add a lot of flavor but if you don't have any you can use this method and it works just as well now it's going to be a bit thick as you can see it's not runny at all 
and it tastes so creamy like when you taste it it coats all the walls of your mouth and it hits the back of your throat like it tastes so good guys you need to try this if maybe you cannot consume any mushrooms or you just don't like how mushrooms taste or you don't have any mushrooms you can still have yourself creamed spinach and this is another way of doing it and at this point you might add your seasonings i added salt to taste you might use aromat or black pepper white pepper anything that will make your cream spinach have more flavor and this is what you're going to have at the end of the cooking it doesn't take very long to cook it is so easy you can do this before load shedding <laughs> if you know how bad things can go you can still cook this for like i don't know it takes not so long to finish and now this is what you're going to have guys your cream spinach it's all done you may use a uh, fresh cream but if you don't have any this is just as creamy as any other type of cream spinach so yeah thank you so much for watching and i hope you tried the recipe please don't forget to like and subscribe to my channel so we can grow and spread the love leave me a heart at the comments so i could shout out at you directly to appreciate your time and your support until we see each other again in another video thank you so much and goodbye